another round of winter hit Yellowstone County overnight. That snow dump causing quite the headache for drivers on their morning commute. As Q2's Andrea Lutz finds out, there's an intricate planning process to clear those streets, and it starts long before the snow arrives. The snow started coming down early Wednesday morning, and it did not quit for quite some time. But the Billings City Road crews, they are trying very hard to make sure these roads are safe. Snow on the roads, but Billings' big orange trucks are to the rescue. Every storm is different. We do our best to try to anticipate what's coming. Road crews with the Billings Public Works are using a calculated process to determine their response when the snow strikes. So right now we're in what we call our salted sand shed and stuff. It's where we store some of our winter materials as far as like the salted sand slicer and then also our UPM, our uh, temporary paving. It, it, a shed that holds about 6,000 tons of material all for clearing the snowy and icy roads. The salted sand it is pretty cheap. It's not bad, but our slicer product, we bring that in on a semi truck, and that's about $7,000 for a truck load. So crews use it wisely, determining a mixture for each storm that will efficiently use both. They call it hot mix. Try to make the best decisions, be the best stewards of the money as we can be, and it's just an ever-changing, evolving thing. And as that snow fell throughout those morning hours, crews were on hand to get the areas in the city in need of clearing. Miller says some drivers come in at 4 a.m., but earlier if need be, and a supervisor constantly checking the weather to make sure they're on it when the snow flies. We can rely on multiple different divisions within Public Works to have guys come in and help us plow sand and do whatever we need to to get it done. Miller says each storm presents its own challenges, but for now they have an economical and somewhat scientific way of getting the job done. In Billings, Andrea Lutz, MTN News.